Well, what you're looking at now is a holograph of Pope Pius X. This is a find from one of our researchers, Monsignor Robert Wister, who was very excited to find this. It's an early 20th century example of a holograph, which is, you know, pretty rare, but very common today. Um, and in particular terms of the text, I'll just flip it around. You'll notice that it's a handwritten letter by the Pope to, who was then the Bishop of Newark, uh, John O'Connor. And John O'Connor poses another interesting story, speaking of manuscripts. Uh, he had a habit of, when he received a letter, he would write the response on the reverse side, so we're missing a lot of correspondence that way, unfortunately. But at the same time, we do have a few things preserved. So it's interesting on the overall to see how voluminous various collections are, from Bishop Bailey, the first bishop, all the way up to Archbishop Myers, who's our current archbishop. So it all goes in terms of what is available, especially in terms of correspondence from the popes, from bishops, from Monsignor, and uh, various priests, all together taken manuscripts and various letters of various kinds, such as the ones here as well, really tell a story in terms of primary source documentation and really highlight our manuscript collections here in Newark.